Hi there, it's Rachel from scrappinghappy.blogspot.com with another crafty video. This month has been a lot of fun crafting up a whole bunch of projects. Um, this particular market project, uh, the cut file came from the, the Silhouette Design Store. It's called Market Stall and I was inspired by Christian from uh, Christian's Crafty and Adventure to make this market stall. Now, believe it or not, she took this picture and turned one into making it 3D from scratch. I, on the other hand, decided to use the cut file and my Cricut to make this project. They had, uh, the, the, the design store had an amazing sale with 50% off um, back during April, I think, when so many people were crafting and stuck indoors to stay healthy um, due to the pandemic. And I took it as an opportunity to buy some fun cut files and thought I would make this 3D one. Now this is cut out using um, paper from uh, die cuts with a view it's a butterfly theme and I have had this paper in my stash forever and I don't know I guess probably in some ways it's probably somewhat outdated uh, it came with this cute little sticker pack um, which I've used to embellish the front I actually made this project for my uh, four-year-old daughter and she loves pink and she's girly and I just thought this would be fun for her to keep knickknacks and collections and things on her um in her, in her room because she's a collector of so many things right now and so I thought this would be a fun thing for her to to put put away things and so uh this was all cut out and made out of paper using my Cricut now to give a little bit more strength I did cut three ones this paper from die cuts with a view is really quite heavy but I wanted it to be more sturdy when I cut it so this is pattern paper and then two layers glued of construction paper and so I did that on both sides and then the pocket the again this is made with um, the pattern paper and what's neat about it is that it has this little thing at the back that you make also out of paper and it sits there and it helps hold the boxes up so it really looks like a market stand. And I thought being that it's summer holidays, we can have a lot of fun with this and play store or something like that. And so this paper rosette was something that I have made. I've been on a crepe paper rosette craze right now and making lots of them to stock up when it's time to make my handmade embellishments. And this pink with the stars just screamed, little girl just screamed um, that it coordinated with this paper. This sweets here was cut out using my Cricut and some scrap uh, glitter paper that I had saved in my scrap drawers. And it just, again, fits perfectly uh, with this. So that was used with my Cricut. I love the little canopy on top. I don't know if you can see very well, but there's tons of little glitter and all of that in the, the paper collection. And then there's lots of glitter as well on the uh, paper and the stickers. So I used also, I decorated the front with the stickers that came with the paper and um, used some borders. So I just kind of really went to town with this uh, in terms of decorating it and making it sweet for something that a little four-year-old girl would love to play with. And I'm really happy with it, how it turned out. I really wanted to film a video so that you could see it before who knows what it's gonna look like once my daughter begins playing with it tomorrow. Um, so thank you so much for joining me of this episode of Let's Get Crafty and we'll see you next time. Take care, bye-bye.